A Tulsa woman is speaking up for the first time tonight about helping get her ex-boyfriend arrested and convicted for possessing thousands of images of child pornography. She says federal agents asked for her help before he could flee the country. The woman tells News on 6's Kristen Weaver she hopes her story inspires others to speak up and to be brave. Angela Teague tells me Jeffrey Reach tried to flee to Cuba after investigators busted him a few days before. So she called authorities and they put her to work. Angela Teague says she met Jeffrey Reach through a mutual friend and they dated for a year. They lived together for four months in Claremore. He was charming, um, very romantic, and as Homeland Security described to me, a sociopath. Two years ago, Teague says federal investigators showed up at their home and told her Reitz was a child predator. I think there were 12 to 15 cars there. There was an armored vehicle. But investigators left, still gathering evidence, and didn't arrest Reitz that day. Angela says after that, Reitz asked her to look up flights to flee the country. Asked me if I would look up on my phone, because he didn't have the, a phone, um, countries that did not have extradition laws. Angela called Homeland Security and agents asked her to take Reitz to the airport that next day before he could escape to Cuba. She agreed and agents arrested Reitz once they arrived at the Tulsa International Airport. Very, very scary time. My motivation was to not let this guy hurt any more children. Reitz has since been convicted and sentenced for having more than a thousand images and videos of child pornography and for having several illegal guns and hundreds of rounds of ammunition. Reitz's attorney tells us his client is apologetic and has accepted his punishment and looks forward to making amends and paying his restitution to victims once he's released from prison. Reitz was sentenced to four years in federal prison, followed by 25 years of supervised release. Kristen Weaver, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.